here is the image which I'm going to edit. Double click on the layer to unlock it. Now click OK. Right click on the layer and click on duplicate. Now go to image, adjustments and make it black and white. Again go to image, adjustment and select levels this time. Now highlight the shadow by moving shadow slider slightly to the right. Now go to the filters, then blur. Now select Gaussian blur. Make radius to 10 and click OK. Now go to the file and click on save as. Save it with any name. I'm naming as displacement map. Click save. Now delete the black and white layer. We do not need it anymore. Right click on the layer and make it duplicate. Go to image, adjustment, then select curves. And move left slider to the right to highlight the shadows again. Hide the layer for now. Now go to the Google and type world map. You can use any image, I'm using this one. Save it to the computer and drag it to the canvas. Now go to edit, free transform and make it bigger and rotate it. Make opacity to 50% so we can see through. Make it bigger to cover the face. Now go to filters, then distort, then select pinch. For this image, I'm making amount to minus 65. and click OK. Now you can make opacity back to 100%. Now go to filter again, then distort, then select displace. Simply click OK. Now select the file which we have saved. It will distort the shape of the map as per the face. Now right click on the map layer, select blending option. Now simply move the right slider to the left to get that shine effect on the face. To make it look more realistic, Simply hold the ALT key and move the slider to the left. It will break the slider into two. Now make adjustment whichever looks the best. Now click OK. Drag the layer in between the both layer. Unhide the layer. and make blend mode to soft light. Make the layer mask. Now we have to inverse the layer mask. To do so, simply press Ctrl I if you are on a Windows and Command I if you are on a Mac. Make foreground color to white and size to 300 pixels and hardness to 0 and make opacity to 50%. 
simply paint it to the shadow part so let's make opacity to 20% brush it below the chin also around the nose and eyes after working on the shadows now select the map layer click on the layer mask make foreground color to black this time from this little icon Now paint it on the area where you do not want the map. So I am removing the map from lips, nose, eyes and hairs. So guys after removing the map from the areas where we do not want, we are done with the final output. So guys I am giving this PSD for free if you want to practice. You can download it from the link in the description.